2020. It has exposed our weaknesses, yes, but it has also shown us our opportunities. Today, we are given the chance to recalibrate our world towards justice, equality and fairness. For us, for nature and for the planet. It's an opportunity we must not miss, but we all need to restart from respect. Imagine all the hands that work in the background, that harvest and pick the raw material at the right time, in the right place, that put all the pieces together to assemble a product, that double check that the product's quality is in line with international standards, that transports it from one side of the world to the other, that loads it, unloads it, that stores it, and that places on the shelves for you to buy. Respect is the foundation of civil society the point is cooperation, a key factor for the development. Respect means interdependence. Sustainable supply chains today are crucial to address the different crises that we are facing. From now, externalities have to be considered. Respect for us at the UN Global Compact means taking into consideration what we call the 10 principles of responsible and sustainable business. That means considering human rights, labor rights, environmental sustainability and anti-corruption. Respect the environment, respect the people, respect yourself. We have to remember that our handprint gives the value to our products. We live in this wonderful world of interconnectedness, where we can eat chocolate from Ghana or drink tea from India. Yet, we can only truly thrive if we use our resources right, if there is respect fair labor and inclusive sustainable development. The next step for sustainable development is to work towards uh, the concept of regeneration, to uh, rebalance all the stocks that have uh, lost harmony in this world. It's about uh, refining that uh, magic balance. And environmental sustainability and social responsibility have to coexist. What I have understood is the great value of an ancient thought. I know that I don't know. The view for the future must be humility, commitment and cooperation. Together with our partners, UNIDO fosters inclusive and sustainable industrial development. Global value chains contribute to industrial upgrading, job creation and the income generation through manufacturing. The current COVID crisis has disrupted global value chains, which has affected economic growth and the achievement of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. Together, we can face this crisis and build a sustainable global economy, resilient and flexible enough to counter current and future challenges. A global economy that leaves no one behind.